Hey everybody, it's JJ Shimo here. I'm here with a video. If you are watching this video, it's because you have asked me on how to get more information on how you can get a thousand likes or more on your fan page in two days. If you watched my previous video, it basically showed you how I, or basically showed you the results that I have gotten from reaching over a thousand likes in two days by using a simple, simple method. And it's practically good for if you're trying to really grow your page quickly, also trying to reach as many people as possible and as well as trying to get more engagement on your page as well because you know the more people you get to that likes your page the more people that you're going to interact with your page and also it's going to actually give you some engagement and show up more on other people's home pages so as you can see like this is some of the pages that uh posts that i've made recently and they already have, they get like likes so i don't really have to worry about that so as long as i keep following this method and probably do it maybe once a month, maybe once every couple weeks, and you can do the same thing, then you'll be able to see the engagement with that as well. Alright? So now we're gonna jump right into it. Of course, this is my page. Um, go ahead and like my fan page if you haven't done so already. It's a the Haitian Mogul. No, excuse at the Haitian Mogul. So well, what we're gonna do is basically we're creating an ad. Okay, for those of you who don't know about Facebook ads, it's something that is definitely great for trying to grow your fan base. Keep in mind Yes, you can use free methods. Yes, you can grow your site and your page and your fan base through that way. But they also have to consider the paid methods because they will give you faster results. They will also help you reach your goal a lot quicker. And all, basically, you're learning how to market yourself as well as your brand so that way you can be seen more. Now, what we're going to do with this Facebook ad is use a simple method that I actually had a guy from somebody else who had helped me grow my page. So I decided I want to share it with you all. So let me just go ahead and go straight to the ads manager and you'll see the results that I got from the actual ad itself. And then I'll show you how to create the ad um, yourself so that way you can go ahead and start uh, <clears throat> start your own marketing campaign. Okay, so here's the ad campaign. As you can see, it was promoting the page. And I had a result of over a thousand likes on it, and it reached 3,500 people. Right. So now, I'm gonna make a fix and do that later. So now you can actually also see that I only spent twenty dollars on that. Okay. And of course, you can do more. You have to basically have a budget to be able to work with, so that way you can actually get more views and more hits to your page. But again, this pays off. And keep in mind, this is how much I paid per like. All right. So it's a really simple method, like I said. It's something that can help boost your page up. If you need more recognition, more views, more hits, more engagement, then you can definitely use this. And it's, it's actually available to everybody who's watching this video. So I'm going to go ahead and just show you guys exactly how to set that up and we'll go ahead and get started. So the first thing you want to do is get to your page, of course. All right, now you go to your page and you click on Promote. Once you click on Promote, you're going to go to Promote Page. Okay, and as you can see, you get all these options. So the one we want to go to is promote your page. That's what we want to use to get likes. We want to use to get engagements. Okay, now with this step right here, this is the part that's going to kind of determine on if people are actually going to reach out to you and it's going to actually um, like the page and so on and so forth. So one of the methods that I was um, taught how to use was use Canva. And it's basically a free website you use to make um, text. You can also create images with it, all that stuff. It is C A N V A. Okay. But for me personally, I like Textgram. So I actually did end up using Textgram to be able to use uh to be able to use on my site, my page. And because I use Textgram for a lot of stuff. So I basically just created an ad with Textgram and put an image behind it. Now the trick with this is when you're doing this, is again, this is gonna determine on how many likes you get. Now, for me, I like quotes, and everybody else pretty much likes quotes. The thing that you're going to be doing, really, let me go ahead and just open this right quick so you guys can see. So, we'll go to Canva. Alright. Now, here is, of course, the Canva website, and you can sign in with, sign up with Facebook, you can log in, or whatever. Um, and basically, it just shows you, like I said, how to create an actual image with it. Now, you can use this method. If you have other methods, you can use Textgram 
and I'm actually going to show you what I use on Textgram. All right, now here are all my images on my Textgram actually account that I use. So I can actually click on this one, and this is the actual image that I actually had shared and promoted. Now you can do the same thing. You can change up your text. Like I can change up this text and say something else. Uh, and usually the quotes that I like to use something very short, first of all, and you also want to make sure that it is also um, something that everybody can agree with. So you can say, uh, my true love is music, don't you, do you agree, or something like that, right? Or if your true love is music, then like this page and share this post. Something like, something like that, that everybody will agree to, especially something that you actually will pertain to when it comes to yours. So like I said, you can update your text, you can change the picture. You know, anything you can actually do anything with this. So like I have a lot of different stuff of my on mine and you, know, you can have obviously use different options to do that. That's with Textgram. And if you want to use Canva, it'll be the same method. Now, if you don't know what quote to put on, you can always search for a short motivational quote, something inspirational. People love those, they grab people's attention. Then you go ahead and create your account, create the image, which is gonna be something very simple. And you also want to create a quote. Now, if you're not sure this is going to take effect, then use a tester image. And now what I'll do is I usually use a tester image and put it into Instagram with a bunch of hashtags, up to about 30 hashtags, and see how much um, interaction that it gets. And if it gets a good, a pretty decent amount, then I'll try it on um, for Textgram because you're going to put money into it. So you want to make sure that you can actually do that. So now once you do that, um, go ahead and actually use find an image. Alright, so since I normally use Textgram, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to set it up with Textgram and then just go from there so that way you can understand how to use it. So let's go ahead and just show you how to do that. So I went ahead and grabbed me, grabbed me a photo of myself so that I was in the gym so that way I can go ahead and just change that up. So I'm going to go here and then click this button and get this. And as you can see, you got my image. You can either blur it out or you can use it the same way it is. Uh, I'll probably leave it blurred out for now. Then go ahead and click on this to edit this text. Select all, and then I'll put a "You are unstoppable." And then put in that, like that. All right. You can change the text color. You can make it white if you think that'll stand out more. Uh, you can remove the shadow, or you can make it a different color. You could also highlight this shadow and make that stand out. Let's see, maybe black, something like that, right? So if you want to do that, you could definitely do that. So we'll use this just for purposes of the video. Saving the image. And I'll go ahead and just send it to myself so that way I can have it, right? Alright, so now that we have that, what we'll do is come here and we'll choose another picture. Choose that picture that I just saved. Create this folder, use that one, and here's the picture. You can move it here. Clear some of this out. Okay, now that we have our picture selected, then we'll let it could continue. Okay, now that the picture is up here, I want to change my text. And I usually want them to show you what you can change yours to. If you like to quote what I already just put it, whatever it is in the image. So I'll put unstoppable. Alright. And then what I'll do is put underneath it. Like the page and 
can share if you agree. Alright? And again, like I said, make sure something that, you, that a lot of people can agree with. It'll be something really simple. And this, again, is just to grow your page so you can get a better idea of how to do that. Alright, once you do that, it'll, you'll, it'll look like this. Alright, that's what you want it to look like. Now, as far as the audience and everything, you can leave it the way it is for now, but I'm going to show you what to do with it in a little bit. Okay? Uh, you can also choose um, the budget. You can do $5 a day, $10 a day. $10 a day is what got me to where I wanted to be, so you can do $10 a day. I'll leave it at five just for the purpose of the video. Okay. And then from there, we'll go ahead and you click promote. All right. So now I'm gonna show you something as well. All right. Um because I'm still I still have an ad running on this one. It's not gonna be promoted as of yet. But I'll show you what I did with the other ad so that way you can understand how to set up your your audience. So once you get this and it says promote, you're gonna to go to your uh, your ads manager. It's going. And I'm gonna show you exactly what you need to do so that way you can publish it. All right. So once you get to your ads manager, you'll see you'll have your ad here. It'll tell you that it's getting ready to be promoted. So what you want to do is go ahead and click on it to click on ad set, which is where it's selected at right now. Then for me, I'm just gonna to go to edit. Like I said, so now I'm just gonna have you guys just follow what I did. All right. You click on edit. Once you get here, you see the option for the daily budget, and you'll see of course my results because it's already completed. Now what I did is uh, is the, the most important part right here is actually have your audience. If you don't have this already set up, go ahead and create a new one. Then you select worldwide. You type in worldwide. When you start typing in worldwide, it's going to give you the option to actually select it. If it doesn't, go ahead and hit enter. Once you hit type in worldwide, and then once you get into the actual exclusion part, then you'll see, like for example, you'll see it says. Where you can what to exclude so you make sure you exclude these particular countries right here because they're going to cost you the most when it comes to getting people to actually update so you can keep the age at 1865 um years and just go from there and then that's pretty much all you really need to do is change the location but once you do that add your exclusion then you hit publish and wait for it to get approved and within like maybe a few hours it'll get approved and as you can see the potential reach was over 1.7 billion so that's because of how broad my my actually uh, my re my, pre my prerequisites will actually work. So if you do something like that, you'll definitely get reach more. If you have a higher daily budget, you'll reach more people as well, and so on and so forth. If you do more days, you'll also reach more people. So as you can see, I reached for the per day, I reached about t max ten thousand, and had a max about forty four four hundred forty page likes. But it just in two days. It shot all the way up to over a thousand likes. So, because you can see this does work, and this is just per you know per day just working it out. So let me know what you guys think about that. If you have any questions for me, let me know. I'll be working on some more of this as well, and um, also showing you how you can do more as far as the next step when you can get a landing page for your opportunity, or if you want to pr start promoting your services like music and things like that to get more clicks to go to your website. So let me know what you guys think. Give me a thumbs up if you like the video. And leave me some comments or email me if you have any questions. And I'll definitely help you guys out with this as well. And thank you again. Thank you so much for the support and for subscribing, liking, and commenting on this on the video before getting here. Um, I thank you guys so much. I'll see you guys on the next one.